You know what I didn't just do? Shadow Hall. What happened? You were missing for a moment. Oh. I... I thought I was done for. I thought perhaps I might have been dead. This... This is all like some sort of terrible dream. But it's real, isn't it? I stood before the night song. I heard Lady Shah's words. And I failed her. Worse than failed her, I defied her. Just because of what that Asimar said. I tried to leave, but Shah blocked me. Punished me for failing her. I thought I knew the limit of pain that the incurable wound could inflict, but... I had no idea. Felt like I was suffering the agony of a thousand people all at once. My blood was boiling, my hair was on fire. I thought I'd claw my own face off with the pain. But then she released me. Banished me, more like. She said I was an outcast. That all of her children would know me and revile me. Shadowheart looks distraught, abandoned by her goddess and all former allies. And as for her divine magic, admitting who empowers her now may break her spirit for good. You're lucky to have such confidence. Me. I think the full price of what I've done has yet to reveal itself. I'm a target to Lady Shah's followers now. Night Song promised she'd tell me something about myself. I need to speak with her as soon as I can. What she said to me back in the Shadowfell about the wolves. That's no coincidence. She took flight to hunt down Kethric Thorm. All I can do is help hasten his demise and hope that answers soon follow. Do you really need to ask? Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. I have a lot on my mind. The shadow fell. Night song. I can think of little else. Um... Yeah. Yeah. Yes. I'm counting on it. I have little else to turn to. The sooner I speak to Night Song, the sooner I'll know what the future holds for me. Assuming I have a future at all. Okay. Um, oh, you're still with us. Cool. Nice. Oh. Guess we'll see how long it lasts. Um, I should nap. The big nap. Very much needed. We did it. Now we're gonna go straight to the place. I feel like I haven't talked to this guy in a Are really long time. I suppose it was only a matter of time until Shah took vengeance. For the Lady of Loss, she does not like losing. <laughs> Casador. Sired seven spawn, me and my six brothers and sisters. He always insisted we were a family, even when he was carving scars into our flesh. I was one of his first, 
Some of the others came years later. He was a monster to us all. But did take special pleasure in my pain. He said, my screams sounded sweetest. And now that I'm gone, I, I don't know. I pity the other six. Don't worry, we'll kill that guy. Holy shit. Okay. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I think we deserve a level up after that. Uh, in case we're there. House of Healing. Chances are we gotta clear the stuff up before we can do that. That's over here. Oh. Oh. I guess we'll Moonrise Towers first. Um Should I try and go in the house of healing? I guess. I mean, I guess. Can I go in this way? Where am I going? Oh, that door was open. Okay. Wait. Remember Stefan? Don't call the doctor yet. I've got potions, switches. I know I can do this. Oh. You're a patient. This is the children's ward. Mm. Triage is back that way. That body she's working on. That's Arabella's father. Oh. Fourteen. Right. That's the little girl that's hanging under a camp, right? Most unorthodox. But I am not one to question the doctor's methods. Do you need something of me? Um. I will sell you what I can once I've stabilized the patient. Not dead. Merely medicated to ease the pain. Hmm. God. Yes. Yes. I knew these hands would not fail me. The patient is sure to recover. Not much left now, but you're welcome to look. I hope that's not cool. Oh no. Oh no. I don't notice these things. She just looked unwell. <laughs> okay. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got to tend to my patient. These aren't... Oh, I think they are. Shoot. Sick. I feel really bad about this. Um... 
Dang. Oh, she's not going to be happy about that. Don't mind if I do. Stressed. Oh, God, um, excuse me. Oh, geez, it's another thorn. The objective of the Scalpel Sisters is to soothe. For the Scalpel indeed is an extension of Sha. See how the patient reacts when I but stroke the right nerve. Hear its comfort, hear the very melody of mercy. Pray, sister. Show us the extent of your beneficence. Stop. Stay your hand, for it slaps where it should stroke. We can hardly hear the patient's sighs of solace. Perhaps it is our unexpected audience that makes you quiver. Come, step forward. You are no sister, but that matters none. Every student is welcome. A curse? Nay, a cure that leads to the very pinnacle of being. Absence. Absence. No other word captures the heart of Shah so very perfectly. It is the scalpel-led journey that leads from pain oh. to peace. Uh, what the fuck is this loon talking about? <laughs> uh, See, what is the I light wish, of uh, there was eyes like a intervene the cancer uh, that button. causes one to witness the laceration? Because we really did just me. watch that happen. Like, if oh well. It's the symptom, then darkness is the cure. For in light there is presence. Could I have saved but that guy? In darkness there is absence. In light is presence. In darkness, absence. You are well on your way, but one white orb disfigures you still. Let us finish the cure. Sister's blades are bloodied and dull. Only the most measured hand could make a clean incision. Mm, Try as you might, you can't think of any relevant teachings. Uh, it's whatever. Um. Uh, tempted to go back in time and just try to, you know, end this guy before he kills that man. Not so. You are quite ready, aren't you, sisters? The scalpel soothes, come sing its song. We would hear your melody of mercy. Is he still alive? 
I mean, he's blind now. Um. Okay. Could I have saved his eyes? Should I go back in time to save that man's eyes? <laughs> Maybe? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. The moral dilemmas. I don't know. Like, oh, can I? Oh. Seems simple enough. See, the problem is I get easily distracted. You know, I'll, I'll look at this. I'll look at this later after I save that guy. Um, two hundred seventy-six. Yeah. Can't. Uh. Okay. Uh. Does he have his eyes still? It doesn't really look like it. I can't really tell. <laughs> the moon be? Why can't they see it? Poor fucker. <laughs>
Got it. to the chair. <laughs> ranks. Oh, 
over there. Come on. The saw's teeth will open the way for her shadow. Still on my feet. Good. <clears throat>
help, please. Why is it always... Mm. Put him up. done that. Gail, you did that to yourself. Oh, sick. Um, cool. Level up time. Hold on. Let me talk to this guy first. Did he still lose his eyes? Damn. Oh well. Wait, wait, we can heal you. We can help. Bro, where are you going? Later. Dude. On Seriously, that's hilarious. Hold on. <laughs> go, go. Let me talk to you. Broski, where are you going? Where did you go? He just ran away. Okay. Whatever. Um. Well, I'm good here, I hope. At least he could see where he was going, right? I'm gonna pretend he did. Uh, 85. That's pretty. Good. That's actually kind of badass. Okay. Level up time. What a strange place this is. That's pretty good. Right. Cool. Some healing for a wizard in need. Okay. Oh, nice little nap. Nice little nap. Okay. Now. 
we can. Okay, well, take everything in this place. Put my hands on everything. And then we can go to Moonrise Terrace. She uh, gonna be a problem. I got rid of the doctor, so. The doctor is absent today. Come back another time. What's she gonna do? Um, 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 where are you? There you are. Can I look at this? A couple turns should do it. Doctor's absent today. I just want to see what's on the desk. Let me work my magic. Oh, right, grounded. Um, no one back home will ever believe this. Hmm. What's hiding here? Wonder what's past this. There we go. <laughs> oh, she's gonna kill okay, us. Let's go to the library. Swift as my feet can carry me. See what's there. Here goes nothing. Then we go to Moonrise Towers. Okay. Oh, it was just open. Girl, how'd you get up here? I could easily unlock it. Okay, guess that's it. 
And now we'll go to Moonrise Rush. Oof. Chug some coffee first. Oh, I should probably, because that's, okay. Understood. No traps, please. Is this rude? Is this impolite? Ooh. Uh. Uh huh. Useful. I feel like I have tried. Okay, so this is heavy armor. Well, well, and well. you don't wear heavy armor. The only person who wears heavy armor is. What's her face? Yo! I think she's already wearing that. Don't walk too close. Shadow to shadow. Yeah, it is her. Oh, we just saved, so it's fine. Why let it go to waste, you know? What to do? Open up. Taking on a tower with no siege engines. Wonderful. Yes. We are fucked. Okay. Unshackled from shadows. She will rise in moonlit glory and carve a path of brightness to the accursed one's second death. So saith the wise Alondo. That beacon of angelic wrath has taken the fight to Catherick on the rooftop, and the first line of defense are dead. But storming the tower won't be easy, and if we wait too long, Catherick will gather his strength and retaliate. For now, though, he's on the back foot for the first time since he returned from the grave. This is it. The spearhead moment. You brought us this far. So how shall we proceed? Oh, um... A sound strategy. Once it's done, me and my harpers will hold the ground floor while you hunt down the general himself. You bet. Floric left some of her flaming fist. They'll scout the prisons and the barracks below to ensure we're not taken by surprise. Say the word, and we're off. Mm. Um... Oh god. <laughs> Which one will keep her alive? That's the question. Because true, when she's there and she'll die, it'll be a mess. But then if it's like, no, if she's downstairs, she'll die. So, I'm gonna save. And if she ends up dead, I'm gonna have to do it all over again. Um, let's go. Just in case. At the ready, Harpers! In this alight, there will be victory. In this alight, we will avenge the fallen! <sighs> the time has come. Gather equal taste of death at last. Yes. 
We are out of spells. Once more to save Baldur's Gate. It's just health. Okay. I guess I should take another rest then. You wanna dance? <sighs> Direct me. Being a Still alive person so is hard. That's progress. Ugh, fine. I must keep going. Get out of the danger zone. There we go. Okay. No. Do I have so much? What do I always collect? Stuff. Okay. I'll give it a shot. Give it a shot? Yes. A shot. A shot. Oh, I need to talk to that kid. Where are they? Where are they? Um, I swear I heard him talking. Another step forward. Oh, he can maybe bring him back. Hmm, I want to have a word. Yeah, I need to talk to her. Hey, where's mom and pops? Can you say that nicer? Mm. Please be nice about it. No. No, no, no. I don't believe you. Why would you say that? It isn't true. It isn't. Get away from me. Go. What are you, you've been talking to? Leave me alone. Why did you deal with that so terribly? Oh my god. Hey, uh... Fate spins along as it should. Can I... Dost thou require a new ally? Or mayhaps a resurrection instead? Mm. <sighs> um... Can we resurrect your parents? Is that a thing you can do since you've been talking? That should be a thing, considering they've been talking. But who knows, maybe... Maybe that's what's gonna happen. So it turned around. Where are they again? Oh, they were here. No. Nope. So then they're over here. Okay. Can I, I talk to you again? So sorry about how I said that. That your parents have unfortunately passed. I don't believe it. 
They can't be. Breathe, child. Resist not the winds of change. Let them carry thee. No. No! Listen. Dost thou not hear it? Where creation meets ruin, where morning meets midnight, the root of all being, balance. They're dead. I can't. Balance. Your very soul is tangled in shadow. Arabella's magic, wild as cursed briar. Her talent is now yours too. Huh? Uh, cool. The girl must learn the ways of the arcane, but she shan't remain here. Arabella holds a power beyond reckoning. That of the decaying forest and the seedling that bore it. But it is unbalanced. Her yoke is already heavy. If she walks thy path, it will surely break. Arabella will depart once thou dost leave these accursed lands. She will find her way safely. Thus, it is fated. Oh, man. You're making me leave. Fear not, girl. The weave knows thy purpose. It will guide thee, if thou dost listen. <sighs> I do trust Withers. I wish I could say both of these. I... <laughs> you feel the grief fade as if it were your own. There is a lightness in her now, veiling the power within, soothing it. Is that my future? Is that why they died? It is. It's wonderful. Thank you, Bowman, for being nice. If there are people like you around, perhaps everything will be all right. Why is it cut off? Yay! Ooh. Ooh. If Bowman says I'll be all right, I'll be all right. I just wish... I wish it was different. I wish Mum and Pops was here. Mm. I don't feel so strong or anything really just tired fair oh uh, man yeah well cool I'm excited to see how she progresses Albert how are you progressing bud what a cutie. Camp life seems to suit the young Elder. The same. His coat of fa Okay. Ooh. Yeah, chunky boy. Okay. Uh, let's go. Let's do this battle. Let's do this thing. Okay. Uh. What's in here? Nice. Whoa. <laughs> I just want to go. <laughs> Oh, it's getting laggy. Hopefully, I'm still alive. Nice. One 
more onto the back. I don't know how many keys I need. I'm just gonna take all of them. I don't know. sound Final save. And now we will go into the towers. 